Kentucky Fried Your Crisp. Job. Hello and welcome to the round two of the ZDY The Drop World Championship. After qualifying, you know what they say after qualifying? We have a. We have a. No, we don't die. We have a sprint race. No, genocide. No, that's even. That's why. That's serious. This is why I got the sword. So it's time to time to take a look at the starting grid for today's rise. After a cracking qualifying, Rosie is our pull sitter. Only a couple of people have ever had pull position. One of them being the person that is at the start line. Start, starting in position number two, did very well in the time trial portion of the qualifying, but slipped at the end. We have Chris. In third, finishing last in time trials, but making it up in the jewels. Slither will be starting in third. And at the back, after after a difficult qualifying session, Hisashi will be starting at the back. But it's not at the end of the world. Anything can happen in the sprint race. So there are three laps to do around this track. <laughs> You should just add some fire around the track to give more damage of clock. <laughs> Don't tell me what to fucking do, mate. <laughs> Attention all teams, this is race control. Stand by for the 30 seconds, 30 seconds. <laughs> Attention all teams, this is race control. Stand by for the start of Todoroki Heights. The sprint race seconds, is about seconds. to commence. Energize your systems and prepare to race. Everybody watch the lights. Watch the lights. It's lights out and away we go for the sprint race of Todoroki Heights. Everyone gonna go fairly decently. This is where, where Rosie had the massive advantage. Can Rosie do it again? Oh, no, this is a three. The ice. Fucking new. Fucking new. As Slither's try as Slither's trying to go for Chris for second place. Chris me. We have another one stuck on the bridge. Another one stuck in the bridge. Another one stuck. Another one stuck. Another one stuck in the bridge. And another one stuck. And another one stuck. And another, and another one stuck. stuck in the bridge. Stuck in the bridge. Someone called oh, Johnny. Someone stuck stuck on the bridge. Where is he having a bit of a lead? But Chris is closing down. Just to clarify, this is three laps, right? Three laps. Three laps. And to clarify for my screen, Rosie's head is still on the bridge while Rosie's phone is empty. What do you mean when you it's it's fine on my end. It's fine on my end. That's the, that's the side that counts. I'm out. I'm out. Quickly jump out. Quickly jump out. I got you. I got you. I got you. Quickly, 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 quickly. Rosie's body was satisfied. On my end, Rosie's fine. Don't you worry. Penguin robot is off. Our race marshal. Chris has gotten stuck! This has opened the door for Rosie to Come extend that place. By the way, she hasn't come in a place because it's technical. Yes, it could. Shut! And they have both just crossed the blue plate and the right foot. Rosie has a massive lead up front of this to to Chris. Going up the top route, feeling like a winner. The winner of the qualifying. Really doing well. Will we have a lights to flag victory? It is completely possible. Okay, for the tent. Chris is starting to fall away a bit. Chris is just entered sector three. We have a spin out, we have a spin out, and sector three and four. And Rosie is just extending that lead, heading in towards the final lap of the race. Yes, you will just send you um, my point of view, by the way, so you can get the uh, overview of you. Yeah, I would love that. Thank you. Yeah. 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 So she has a fight change with the power of Nip Nip. Let's go back and forth. 
Meanwhile, well, Rosie is just absolutely slaughtering the competition. Potentially, we could be seeing some lap people struggling. Oh, dear. Rosie is simply the monarch of Todoroki Heights for this season. I haven't done high school racing in my time. But it, but it's clearly come back to you at the right time. Yeah, it oh, might. Raining the perfect time. It might be raining, but it doesn't matter. I'll finish the race. What am I gonna do with my boots? Gonna get wet? Oh no! How dare it! And there, Scott, and of course, let's call they're on uh, lap three. As Ro as Rosie comes round, final time round the Azuka Tunnel <laughs> to cross the line and win. The sprint race! This will also mean that Rosie will start in pole position for the actual race. As we watch Chris come along about 15 20 seconds back at the end of that to cross the line. Commentator Robert, how's it looking at the back? Uh, there's a massive gap uh, between Nesico and a. Was Tula in third place in this one last? As we, as we're, as we're watching an aerial view of Slither. <laughs> as you know what the fight that's going to be. Slither is about to make a jump right here. Slither. Oh, they're stuck in the wall. Oh, they're going down the wall. Slither. So they're going through the Azuka Tunnel. Oh, they have spun out. To cross the line in third position to gain some points. As there is a fight going on on the bridge. <laughs> Save that for Battle Bridge, people! That's not the bridge you fight on. That's the bridge that you feel. <laughs> <laughs> and now... That is my second toilet. <laughs> and now as we watch Hizashi finish the lap of... lap of honor. Down for the Izuka Tunnel for the last time. In this sprint race. That's a bit of a moment, but it's okay. At it's okay. least, at least, Hisashi finished the race, unlike Robert in season twenty, and across the line. Uh... <laughs> now it's time to calculate the scores. Wait, what did Robert do? Uh, in season twenty, I span so much out of control. I mean, basically, f you cut out. We'll see. In season 20, I puked because I spanned that one. Always. You'll see the scores on your screen in the next two seconds. And we will see you for episode number three, where we have Todoroki Heights 11, the actual race. See you then. Wait, we have to do it again. Yes, Rosie, we do it again after the results of this round. Rosie's the winner of the challenge with a time of 3 minutes 50.120 after three laps of racing. Chris is in second with 17 seconds down on Rosie, so they're a further 39 back, and Hisashi managed to squeeze in within 100 seconds of Rosie crossing the line. How does this turn into the championship points? Well, Hisashi gets 6 points for finishing last, so they gets 9 points for finishing in third, Chris, the runner-up of the challenge, gets 12, and Rosie gets 15 for winning and extending that championship lead to 18 points with a score of 30. Let's see what happens during the actual race next time. See you then.